Road Atlanta is just a great track. I really enjoy going there, especially for Teed. There's a lot of fans coming out there and um, winning the fifth championship now, um, I have to say this year was probably the toughest one. It came down to not make any mistakes, which we as drivers didn't do. The guys in the pits um, did awesome pit work at every race and also we didn't have any technical problems. Everyone is always working on, on little improvements through the year on the complete car. It's aerodynamics, it's setup, it's kinematics, it's on the engine, um, it's really everywhere. That's what it needs to be competitive in GT class nowadays. Driving the RSR on the, on the racetrack is one thing, but being able to drive the GTS on the street, uh, you can definitely feel all the improvements that have been made to that car from the generation before. right in the middle between a Carrera S and a GT3, uh, which is probably as close as you can get to our race car. My daily driver is a Carrera S, and I really enjoy driving the GTS because it has little improvements in a lot of places. Uh, with a wider track, we also have a wider rear tire on the GTS. There was also some changes in, in springs and damper settings, and for me as a driver, I could really feel that. Yeah, the extra power compared to the Carrera S is really impressive, even though it's only 23 horsepower, you can definitely feel it. You have a lot of grip on the, on the rear end, and um, yeah, it's just a great balance in the car at all. The evolution of the 911, uh, starting with the first models uh, and now to the GTS, you still know you're driving a 911 when you get in the GTS. Obviously the cars nowadays and the GTS are much, much better than they used to be. The refinement uh, Porsche has done over the de decades to the cars and uh, it's very impressive uh, how well Porsche has done its work again.